Hi, my name is Hiro from ICOM Australia. Today, so we are in the Jesu Park, uh, Melbourne, Victoria. So today, I'd like to show you about our new VHF and the UHF new analog amateur transceiver. Um, this is ICT-10. The ICT-10 is a traditional and simple VHF and UHF analog transceiver. It is an evolution from the ICT-73s. We are keeping our traditional user interface from the ICT-70, but changing and refining the functions. Also, the ICT-10 includes our professional land mobile transceiver technology, which was refined over many years and is included into our icf 1003 radio. This is the first time we are bringing this technology to an amateur radio product. Rugged compact dual bander and achieved IP67 rating into our newest direct conversion circuit technology. Independent control dial and audio per volume. Powerful internal speaker. FM broadcast receiver function. Home channel key function. So the ICT then includes a BP28 battery pack, high capacity battery pack, and MB133 belt clip. And like this. And this is a whip antenna for VHF and the UHF antenna for FYS 270C. And also include a, a rapid charging uh, charger cradle, BC213, and AC power pack, this is BC242, but this is depending on the version. Let's take a close at the ICT10. This is a 50 ohm SMA type connector, an independent control dial and audio power dial. The control dial changes the operation frequency and the memory channel. And it's how you select the modes. The audio power dial adjusts the audio speak output level and switch the power of the transceiver on and off. This is a home channel key, which is how you set the radio to your preferred channel. We have increased the internal speaker output power. Here is a microphone and function display area. These are operation keys. The keypad backlight improves the visibility, which is perfect for nighttime or dark time situation. Press the band key to select the preferred operation band and FM broadcast band. And 10 key part area, enter the frequency and memory channel number. This is an external speaker microphone jack uh, with a secure cover. So when you connect uh, our optional uh, microphone, make sure to connect and screw it all the way in. If it's not secure, it can impact its IP67 protection rating and your radio may get damaged by water. So this is a, a very secure uh, a microphone jack cover. 2.5 mm for microphone and 3.5 mm to audio speaker output. Also, when you programming the radio, you can plug the OPC478UC-1 cable here. So I want to show you how to connect HM222HLWP. Make sure the screw for tightening. So when you connect the microphone, definitely turn off the radio. This is a new DC power adapter, the AD149H. 
it accepts input from your travel boat DC power source using the OPC 254L or cigarette plug cable on your vehicle using CP12L. When using the AD149H at home or in the vehicle, you don't need to worry about the battery consumption. If you want to program the radio, the CST10 programming software is now available on our website. You can download it for free. So if you have any question about ICT10, please contact us. So that's all from me today. Thank you for watching.